Hi, I'm Sheldon Brummel. I'm the Great Plains Master Beekeeping Project Coordinator. Today we're going to be talking about the Great Plains Master Beekeeping Program. Beekeepers are extremely important. We know honeybees play a vital role in the agro ecosystem around us. Even with our large wind pollinated crops, we still have a lot of different orchard and fruit varieties as well as vegetables that are produced in the central US and honeybees are a vital part of that. So the beekeepers themselves are a vital part of the agro ecosystem in the central US. So the Great Plains Master Beekeeping Program is a competency hierarchy for beekeepers. So you have apprentice, journeyman, master candidate, and then when you complete it, you're a master beekeeper. That's the hierarchy. The competency part is at each level, you have a kind of grade of knowledge that is being built upon year by year as you progress through the program. So apprentices, they focus a lot on management, just keeping your bees alive, understanding what that organism is. Journeymen, they get to start to build okay, I've got these bees and they're surviving. How do I start to grow them? How do I grow a business from them? And then the master level, you get to start teaching other people about bees. You get to start growing your business even larger if you, that's what you want. You can kind of pick your own path in this program as you, as you advance through it. And the most important part is you get to turn around and teach the people below you in that hierarchy. I'm Dr. Adam Ingreo, co-founder and national director of the Heroes to Hives program. And through our partnership with the Great Plains Master Beekeeping course, our Heroes to Hives students, our veteran beekeepers learning their first year in beekeeping, have an educational pathway past the Heroes to Hives program. We're a one-year intensive beekeeping program, and our students are able to transfer their course credits to GPMB to fulfill their apprenticeship level of the program and continuing their beekeeping education. So that's what GPMB does for us. It gives our veterans a pathway to master beekeeping certification and further education for their beekeeping endeavors. So in the structure, we obviously have the apprentice, journeyman, and master candidate levels, and then you complete a project and you are now a fully fledged master beekeeper. But inside of there, you have to have these different checkpoints that check you along the way to make sure you're displaying those competencies. So the way we've structured that is unlike any other programs in the US, so we have a three-pronged approach. We partner with associations across the states. We get live bees at different locations across the whole central US, and you have to show that with a mentor or at these open apiaries that you can actually handle bees and you can display and show that you know what you're talking about when you open up a beehive. And that's your field training, so that's one of the prongs. The second prong is gonna be the actual volunteering. So that's where you give back to the beekeeping community at large. That's where we require beekeepers to have those volunteer hours so that they can give back. So those beekeeping associations that partner with us actually have a workforce that can help them with all this training and all of these different goals that they have regionally. And then the third prong is gonna be the actual training itself. So that's both online and in-person training. The online training is just modules that are gonna teach you about bees all the way from their biology to their role in the agro ecosystem. Those are different learning objectives that can all be found in each level. So those are the three prongs, volunteering, field training, and then you have your actual learning either online or in person. Uh, Great Plains Master Beekeeping for me, uh, it was one of the first communities I had for beekeeping. Um, the, the whole saying goes, you ask two beekeepers a question, you'll get three different answers. So Great Plains Master Beekeeping for me was an area to get one answer that everyone can answer to. Also the studying ability, they lay everything out for you on what is expected to be learned. Uh, being a 20 year vet, that was everything. It's a great resource for our beekeepers to be able to spend time when they're not in their hives, studying to be able to understand beekeeping. The three levels, apprentice, journeyman, and master take the beekeeper through the course of more advanced learning. And again, the great thing is it's a free resource that we can offer our members. So each learning objective has kind of a competency associated with it. And those range from bee biology to also bee management skills. Those ones kind of work together. It's how you work the hives. It's what is inside of those hives. How does that organism work? And then you have your land stewardship. 
the land stewardship side is how do I feed my bees? How do I make the land around them more inviting? Because the environment is what feeds the bees. We can't just pour sugar on them and then have them be okay. We can't keep them confined. They are impacted by the landscape around them. So we teach people about that. Then the next thing is gonna be the business side. So how do I make more bees? How do I make this profitable? Or at the very least, how do I make this a hobby that's not too expensive? And then the last one is gonna be professional development. The professional development side is gonna be, how do I share this with other people? How do I take my love of this insect and of these, this organism, how do I share it with the public without bouncing around, without sounding too crazy? And how do I take it so that someone who maybe won't stick their hands in a box full of 10,000 stinging insects will actually take away the love that I have for these insects and actually start to care about them even if they're not gonna become a beekeeper themselves. Great Plains Master Beekeeping has allowed us to provide the, our region with an open apiary location. This location started out as my personal hobby and it has expanded from one hive to eight hives over the last six years. So if you wanna get involved or find out more information, go to our website, there you can start the program itself or you can also just look at resources. So you can look for field training sites. We also have downloadable resources. We have beekeeping calendars. And if you're not into beekeeping, we also have guides on difference between a wasp and a carpenter bee, how to deal with carpenter bees, um, fun flowers to plant for your region, different things just to help bees out. And those are all free resources located at the website. And then if you want to continue your education, if you're sure you want to take honeybees on and you want to take this adventure on, you can actually go create a username and start your training online at any time. And it's a self-paced program as well.